What's up, motherfuckers? It's your neighborhood ghost, Ghosty, and welcome to another speed paint video. So, if you haven't seen my previous videos on these little ghosties, I would recommend checking those out, and of course, my character's redesign as well, as you get an idea what this is all about. So, to make it like a short summary for those who don't want to check those out, basically, I'm doing these little series called Drawing My Ghosties. I be uh, drawing my little ghosties that are part of my character that travels around with her, which her name is Ghost who is a ghost-human hybrid and each of these ghosties have abilities and some of them do have like consequences and all that. We had Goo who can give uh, people ghost abilities when he's combined with somebody. Uh, they can like fly, they can face through things, all that stuff. But when it comes to ghosts, I think I've already just, uh, explained in the actual video where she gets like a full-on ghost form with goo and she's the only one despite other ghosts probably trying it and they have no result and that's the thing we had zook oh yeah goo is the green one i can't forget goo is the green one we have zook the purple one the sleepy ghost he is super fast and when he combines with people he makes people fast but of course he's got a consequence where if uh, you go too fast or you use it too much, your muscles will ache and probably like you'll pull muscle, that sort of thing. And uh, going back to Goo, it's probably like you have to be careful with him in case like if you're facing through a wall, you can't. If you un like unbind with each other, you're probably going to be stuck in the wall and yeah, that's going to really hurt. That sort of thing. So this is the third installment of my little ghosties. I have 10 in total, but I have six originally before I did the redesign. When I added four more, so I'm doing the original six first before doing the ex four extras. And this little ghostie is my third one. This ghostie is the yellow ghost called Pookie. Uh, his sort of like personality chase is basically he's silly, he's a bit dumb, and he's like that one ghost that will just eat anything, even if you shouldn't be eating it, like a phone or just like random battery or sort of thing. He's got like a a limited stomach even though that's not his power he, he he would probably end up eating things that looks delicious to him so like probably like a i don't know like i said a phone glasses pencil pen books that is pooky right there he like i said he's the yellow ghost he's like the silly one and his ability is that he can shift his body into different shapes it's like become a little pillow marshmallow he can uh, become like a shape of an animal which I have illustrated in his like character sheet where he's like a rabbit or a bunny well my attempt to draw a bunny or a rabbit and he can like morph his body and he can actually look like the shape of a person as well hair and everything but he'll still have his pooky look um he doesn't like he isn't like a full-on shapeshifter where he actually becomes the actual item he just becomes the shape of it and for him to work with somebody it's not really gonna work very well uh because with certain ghosties they have consequences which i already mentioned with zook his consequence is that if your body cannot handle shift as in like if you want if you're like granimal and stuff and you want to escape through like bars and stuff and you want to use them He's going to be moving all your bones and muscles, and that's going to hurt. And even if you morph back into the shape that you were, all those bones and muscles are going to be broken. And you won't be able to move, and that's kind of like a setback for him. And if you morph too much, you will probably uh, be some deep on that, basically. <laughs> He's like one of the most difficult ghosties with the difficult ability that can work with somebody it just depends on the body type and if it can handle that sort of type of like shifts uh if you're like very flexible i guess uh, it kind of works but it'd probably dangerous more dangerous to like a human um and this actually is kind of dangerous for ghosts herself she again she's a hybrid between a ghost and a human She's not full on ghost, so she can't really morph her body into like certain like shapes and sizes. She can't do that. 
because she'll just end up breaking her bones, her muscles, and everything. So it's 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 difficult even for her. Now this is where I mentioned before with certain ghosts, they would need another ghost for it to work. And that other ghost that could work for Pookie is Goo with Ghost herself. Now, as I already explained, Ghost does have a ghost form which she has with Goo when they both combined. And it's kind of like her stronger form. It's kind of like a Dragon Ball Z where this is this is not my strongest form yet or something. I can't remember. I haven't watched uh, Dragon Ball Z for a long time. So, um, yeah. It's basically like that, and when Pookie comes into the picture, she can like shift her body into different shape sizes, stretch her arm out, which I have like illustrated when she's like going all like ghost uh, with one of her arms, and it's like stretching just to show that that's his ability when it works with her sort of thing, and that is really how Pookie works. Uh, he might have like the, one of the dangerous powers to be used because it will just end up being with you being in the hospital or something or 10 feet under Now seven ten. Well, I'm changing my numbers right now But yeah, it, it's just like that sort of basics where you have to have someone who can handle that sort of body shift The possibly like ghost that doesn't have like no like body sort of thing they can do it even though they probably be able to do it anyways or you have someone that's like an actual shapeshifter, but it increases their limit of like how much they can like shift. Or you have ghosts with her ghost form, which works very well, and it, she doesn't have any consequences. And that is pretty much how Pookie works, and that is basically Pookie himself. So, um, yeah. <laughs> Again, this is the third installment. I will be doing another one hopefully soon. I want to try and get these ghosties done before the end of the year, so uh, hopefully I'll get there. They might go over um, next year, but I'm not quite sure. It depends uh, how quickly I can draw these little guys. So um, yeah, hopefully you guys do like uh, Pookie and the ghosties so far. If you're hoping to see the next ghostie, please may let me know in the comments below. I already know someone wants to see Hoop already. I, I saw you. I saw you down there. So, um, yeah, so we do have some others. There's 10 in total and we're already on the third ghosty. Uh, I think it's been a while that I've uploaded a video. I think, I can't remember the last time I uploaded on this like channel. Um, I haven't done much art as of late, but I'm going to try and do some art. So, um, yeah. Again, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, uh, leave a like and comment down below what you think of Pookie and which ghosty that you know that you want to see or like if you want to talk about the little ghosties and a little bit lower I guess uh, you can comment down below and I'll see if I can uh, comment to your question or anything but um yes but if you do enjoy my uh, content and if you do enjoy my art please subscribe not that <laughs> please consider subscribing it'll help a lot with the channel and it lets me know that people are interested in my art and stuff so um yeah that is pretty much it for me go see go sing out i've been getting out of bed these past few days think it's fair to be proud about it i've quit ordering from all those fast food chains i'm feeling better there's no doubt about it and my days are brighter my shoulders are so much lighter just for a moment there i thought that there was nothing more to life i thought about it wrote a couple songs about it just for a moment there i lost myself mind if i be real for a minute it's almost like everything i feel had a limit it now gone past